Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Just wanted to show you guys a quick video on how I washed this deck for a bar and restaurant recently. Had all of these grease stains and uh, a lot of foot traffic on this, so you can you can tell how dirty it was. I uh, got the truck showing right here, the nice skid, and I'm gonna show you guys, just kind of walk you through the process and how I washed it. Uh, so what I'm doing first is I'm just kind of pre-wetting, uh, wetting down the deck before I apply my degreaser. I'm using LA's Awesome, and I'm just putting that in a pump sprayer. So I'm just watering down uh, the deck, getting it ready, just blowing off all that surface dirt before I apply any solution. Uh, I'm just kind of going around spraying. I'm doing a 50-50 mix, but I do uh, upgrade it to a almost full mix of just LA's Awesome. But I'm just going around spraying it and wetting down the vegetation. So even though it's just a degreaser, still want to make sure I water down the plants uh, just to be on the safe side, even though it's not sodium hypochlorite. Uh, this degreaser, you just want to be on the safe side. And I had to agitate, but as you can tell, once I brush this stuff off, it's just coming off and it's looking super good. This is an old deck, so it's not going to look perfect and the client knew that, but they wanted it to look a little bit better than how it does now, especially with uh, Memorial Weekend coming up. So I just got this soft bristle brush from Lowe's and just brushing that. This was the worst area right here. This is where they're the cooks and the kitchen members take out the trash and it just kind of drags all the way down. So this cleaned up real good. I'm just rinsing it. This took quite a few extra coats. So I did this probably maybe three or four different coats on that one area around. So this is the other side right here. As you can see that LA is awesome on the left side of the camera. And again, just kind of pre-wetting everything. LA is awesome is great whether you're trying to do uh, gutter brightening or remove oil stains or remove uh, grease stains. It does a great job and it's real cheap. It's only a couple dollars from the, the dollar store. So putting that in the pump up spray and then just doing the same exact thing. The way I landed this job was one day we were at this bar and I noticed how dirty it was. So the next day I called and I asked to speak with the manager ended up sending them a bid and I didn't hear back for a couple months. So I, I recently followed up with them. I sent them an email uh, just seeing if they had any questions regarding the quote. Got a call back almost immediately and they wanted to move forward with it and get it washed before Memorial Day weekend. So that was pretty cool. That just goes to show you, uh, make sure you follow up with your leads, especially you know, if, uh, if it's a local company like this, maybe they just forgot to get around to sending you that email or giving you that call back. So just make sure that you follow up with those, those leads. This is the after turned out really, really good. Looks a lot better. We're going to go ahead and probably do a, a monthly cleaning on this one to make it look even better. Cause, uh, there's a lot of foot traffic on, on this bar. So monthly cleanings will definitely make it look better consistently. But yeah, this is this is how I cleaned it with just using LA's Awesome in a couple hours and it was all looking good. So if you guys have any questions, feel free to put them in the comments. I'll try my best to answer them as good as I can. But until next time, I'll see you all in the next video.